My name is Donetta Lavinia Grays, and I wrote a play called Last Night and the Night Before. This is my first time at the Colorado New Play Summit. Last Night and the Night Before centers around a young girl named Sam, who is 10, and suffers a traumatic event in her life. And she has the unfortunate position of being at the mercy of the adults in her life and having to suffer the consequences of their decisions. Why didn't you say nothing? I did, Mama. You ain't listening to me. Watch your mouth. Yes, ma'am. Fix yourself up. Monique pats Sam's hair back with her hands. Let me see your teeth. Come on. Warm the sun up, baby. Their decisions around trying to safeguard her from what she's suffered. It is a play about the tremendous enduring component of love in our lives. It is a play about loss. There's a lot of humor in it, but there is a lot of charged emotion. And it is a play about family, um, but it's also a play about finding your singular voice as a woman and coming into adulthood and the, the cyclical nature of being a woman. It takes place both in a fictional southern Georgia town called Vixton and in Brooklyn, New York. And we see throughout the show how Sam has grown up, the nature of the traumatic event, and how her journey to Brooklyn is meant to safeguard her from what's happened in Vixton. Nadima, Sam's coming in the kitchen to help you out. Mm -hmm. Sam, go in there and let Auntie Nadima know what you want to eat, baby. Yes, ma'am. Hey, watch her reluctantly exit. Rachel, a little satisfied. Where is it? And in the car. One of the things that Sam does throughout the play is plays hand games. And we learn how those childhood hand games are used as a form of, of settling her, her spirit a little bit. And one of the games is last night and the night before I met my baby at the candy store. And I think that particular phrase also supports the structure of the play as well because we go back in time sometimes and so it, it recalls the memory as well. <laughs>